Okay, we're at our first stop. This is the Goodwill in Santa Ana off of Grand. Let's go inside and check it out. I love that they're still doing the Barbie Dream House Fantasy here. Here's the Halloween decor. Oh, a little Zoom Zoom. Okay, I'm in the back. They just brought out like a couple of these cards. So I wanted to see what was on them. Bunch of hats. Okay. What does this look like, Coach? Oh, I don't think it is. Targus. Is there any cool bags or luggage over here? This is a Target piece. Not a tight baker. E S. Don't know that one. Okay, handbag time. Nine West. This is Kenneth Cole reaction. Leather and leather. Oh, this is a Rebecca Minkoff. That's only eight bucks. That's cute. I think we can get this. I think we might even be able to sell this one to Crossroads. Is that a pen mark though? Hmm, now I'm not sure. There's some marks on the back. But let's see if we can find anything else cool. What is this? Oh no, that's not something. Oh, there's this Ted Baker, but it's also pretty stained as well. This one looks like a long chomp, but it's not. That one's only five bucks. This is another, no, this is like a clever, I think. Fossil? Yeah, fossil. This one's $12.99 though, I think. Okay, let's see what else we can find. Oh, selfie lights. Hair rollers. Lots of toasters. Keurigs. Let's see what kind of home decor stuff they have. Kind of cool. Some Target, $8.99. This planter is kind of nice. $2.99. Lids. Oh, that one's broken. Okay. Casa lids. Bunch of Christmas. Plates, polka dots, $1.99 each. They also have a bunch of like faces and stuff over here. But I don't think I saw anything too exciting when I was looking through. I thought that they were, these were carrots, and I thought that they looked like um, like goldfish, but they're like light bulbs. There's a lot of them are broken though. But these are from Target. Oh, these plates are cool. Ninety nine cents each. Those are pretty. Ooh, shiny. These are from like Home Goods or something. Oh, that 222 fifth. Robot mug. Oh, we're in the mug section. My favorite. Oh, tea. This one's an anthro mug. 
Yep, there's a letter A one. Yes. Is there a letter E? Oh my gosh, that'd be so funny if I could spell the word T. But there's just those two. They're $1.99 each, I think. But I have each of those letters already. You know, I, I found my boxes of mugs. I need to see what what letters I have. I think I'm almost complete, but I still have to check off check out all the letters and see if I have them all. Do I see any interesting glassware? These are Ikea. These little ones are kind of cute. We have so many of these vases from Target. Oh, there's more over here. Oh, I like the mushrooms. Are the mushrooms on sale yet? Eleven ninety nine. I always like to look for cool lamps, except I have nowhere to put them because I have so many. Chairs. Oh, I do like that chair right there. That one's pretty cool. Oh, these are nice, like bar stool chairs. These are 60 bucks each. Oh, I also like this little side table, but it's missing the bottom piece or the top piece. One of the pieces is missing. Okay, they kind of mark these down. Like this one's only four bucks. Do I need to get some of these? Like this one would be, oh, it's inflatable. That's not like a floating thing, is it? How much is the giant leaf? Six bucks. Ooh, this one's only $1.99. Definitely getting these. Okay, this is perfect. I'm gonna stock up. How much is this one? Oh, see, this one's the expensive one. Oh, this one's on sale. This one's only gonna be five bucks. Okay. I think today's my day to stock up on these. This is perfecto. What else do we have here? What's, how much is this? Is this five bucks also? Oh, this is only $1.99. Nice. All right, just got to Crossroads, yay! Okay, we got uh, Marco Jacobs wallet, there's Tory Burch. I like that floral Tory Burch right there, that one's really cute. We got some Balenciaga. These two are Weissman boots, amazing. Chloe for $3.75, some Jimmy Choo, some Louboutins, and that Philip Women's half off. Okay, I found this Tory bag. There's also this really cute, like, Kate Spade belt bag, and then it's Tory, but they're all like, I don't know, pricier than I'd want them to be, I think, but I don't know, they might still be good. But this Kate Spade's 55. You guys, this shirt is so cute, as an h and m from Moschino. How fun is that? Hey guys, we are back at the house and I'm really excited to show you guys what we ended up getting today. We went to the Goodwill and then we also went to Crossroads as well. And okay, so at the Goodwill, I <laughs> just bought a bunch of pool floats. Cause I, I think I talk about this a lot, especially recently. Cause I'm like, I've been waiting for the pool floats to go on sale and they have finally started marking them down. Not all of them were marked down, only like a couple different styles and only like ones on a certain table were on sale. There, there were more on another table to the right. None of those were on sale, they were still full price. But I got this one, I love the cats. This one was only $1.99 and they just changed the price recently too. I think before it was $2.99, you can see it underneath. These used to be $2.99, now they're $1.99. But I think the thing is they went on sale. So then like they were $2.99, I think they went on sale so they were like half off so they were $1.50, but it's okay. I missed it. And so cute though, I love the kitty cats and the color, super fun. Now, uh, this would have been perfect for our party the other day because the kids were out in the pool but this is an inflatable golf putting green and this is super cute um i i probably wouldn't have the kids like golfing into it but we do have like um 
they they have like bean bags and they also have like those just like little ball things that you can throw into here too and play kind of like cornhole with this so got this this should be this sh they should have fun with this one and it's still like hot right now too i feel like the weather has just been nuts recently it's been in the 90s it was in the hundreds like earlier this past week and now it actually rained tonight when i was driving home and I think it's supposed to be cooler this week, and then it's going to get warm again at the end of the week. So I don't know what's happening with the weather. It's crazy. But this was $2.99. Love that for me. Ooh, this one was only $1.99. And I love these donut ones. I feel like every year I pick these up. And this one was only $1.99. Good old donuts. I should have gotten another one of these, but... I was like, do I need a, like, how many donuts do I need? I was trying to go with, like, variations, you know? Ooh, this one was really cute, too. This one was also $1.99. And this just has, like, different fruits on it. Cherries, oranges, bananas, and all that good stuff. So, I got these. Oh, hold on, I got two more. <laughs> okay. I also got... Ooh, this one was pretty fun. This is like a floating lounge chair. The kids are going to have a kick with this one. This was only $1.99. Now this one, like if they had more of these, I would have gotten this was the only one. But it has like little drink holders too. The kids are going to love that one. They're going to fight over it for sure, these. And then... I wish they had another one of these too. This one was... Or this one was... Uh, they're like, they're, I guess it's like a sw connected swim tubes. And it looks like, like a floating bed. How cool is this? And this one was $10, but half off. So this was only five bucks. This was the only one that was on sale. Ah, uh, so fun and glittery in the inside too. Cannot wait. I don't know if I'm going to let them use these yet though. Because like summer... I don't know how long it's going to be hot again. Like, I don't want them to just, like, use them once, you know? Like, I like to inflate, like, a couple of them at the beginning of the summer and just let them use them. Or, like, when more, like, when people come over, we can blow up some more. I also like to give them away to people with pools. <laughs> like, the kids in the neighborhood, <laughs> like, they have pools that are, like, friends with my nephews. When they come over, I'm like, hey, you guys want some, like, some balloon floats? They're like, yeah! So... They're like the literally the perfect gift, so I love that. And uh, next up, I got two Lululemon pieces. I got a pair of shorts right here. These were $24. Just a great pair of like, they're kind of like gray and black shorts. I just love Lululemon shorts so much. I just noticed though that these don't have like pockets on the sides. There is a back pocket. Oh, it's tiny. Wait a minute, how did I not notice that these didn't have shorts, or pockets? Oh well, can I make it work with the pocket in the back? We'll see. I can always return this and exchange it, so that's totally fine. I saw these and I saw like another pair, like I got another pair first, but then I saw these and I was like, oh I actually like, like the print on this one better, so I went with these instead, but these don't have pockets. I knew the other ones did have pockets, but it's okay. Shorts don't always need pockets. That's you, when you have a bag that you can put your bag in, your your wallet in, or your wallet, your phone in. Whatever, my brain is not working anymore. It's too late for this. Um, next up, I got these Lululemon joggers. I love these joggers so much. I actually have three of these already. So I have a pair in like, an, like a darker like olive green. And then I have a pair in blue. Like a navy blue. And then I have a pair in... I think I actually have two pairs in the olive green. Um, and then now I have like the lighter green. <laughs> it's unhinged. I love these like these joggers so much. So they are so comfortable. And I love them. These were 28 bucks. I think I'm going to give a pair to like my brother or my dad though. Um, of the ones I have, like, two of the same in. But I think they're different sizes. Like, one's a smaller size and the one's a larger. But, yeah, as long as they fit. It's, like, all that matters. Um, then I got 
these two bags. First one, I have this Madewell satchel and it's just in black leather. I love the leather on this bag. It's so nice I also really like this front pocket right here Nice and large very roomy. I like the way that the like it buckles I thought that like that was like kind of cool like it goes up and it does zip across the top And then in the inside you got a zipper pocket and then two open pockets. This one was $22.50 on sale and then I also, it also does have a crossbody strap, and it's adjustable and removable. Ding! Then, our last bag, I got this beautiful Tory Burch. I think this bag is so nice. It's in this beautiful, like, camel tan colored Safiano leather. Has a little hang tag right there. Um, it is, though, it is missing the crossbody strap. It does have the D-rings to attach the crossbody strap to. And I feel like this style would look pretty cool with, like, a fun guitar strap. So I'm going to see if I can find one, if I have one that would look good with this. And if it does, I'll include it uh, when I put it up for sale. Otherwise, you can, if you have a guitar strap for yourself, that would be beautiful on here. Because I feel like this color is, like, so neutral. Like, any cool, like... Um, guitar shop with like a fun pattern would look fantastic with this. Plus I like that juxtaposition of like the fun colors of the fabric with like the Safiano that's like more stiff and a little bit more formal so I think it'll make it more fun. Or you can do just like a different colored strap with this like a black strap would be nice with this or even like a like a brown one just because this color looks good with a lot of things. And then it has a magnetic snap across the top to kind of like keep it closed. And then interior, you have a middle zipper pocket, another zipper pocket in the back, and then another open pocket in the front. And it is in pretty good shape on the inside. It's like nice and clean. I don't think I see any pen marks, which is fantastic because the pen marks have just been kind of like popping up all over the place for me. I've been finding so many great bags, but they're like riddled with pen marks. It's just like, Ugh, it's too much. Put the caps on your pens or have like a special pouch or something where you can keep your pens in just in case they decide to explode so that way it's not exploding all over the interior of your bag and all over your other stuff inside there. So yeah. And that is it though. That is it. That is our last item for today. I hope you guys had fun checking out the store with me seeing what I found. Don't forget to tune in tomorrow bright and early at 7 a.m. for a new video. Check out the next live sale as well. I will link that down for you in the description box. And you can also hit the video um, tab here on my YouTube channel page. And then all the scheduled lives for the rest of the month should be up there. And otherwise, they're usually every Saturday. Every Saturday at 10 p.m. Pacific time. Sometimes I come on a little bit earlier. Sometimes I try to come on at 9 if I can. But the traffic here is horrendous. So I can never make any promises that I come on before 10. But that is it for today. I love you guys so much. I'll see you guys all in the next one. Bye!